Welcome back to my channel. This is Beauty with Cat, and today I'm here to give you guys another wig review. This time I am reviewing the hair from the Perfect Hairline series from Outre, and her name is Freya. Y'all, so once again, I am picking colors that are baby, they're bold, okay? They're bold. It's giving black Goldilocks, okay? This is the inside and the outside of the wig. She does have three combs, two on the sides, one in the back, and adjustable straps as well as that glueless band. Again, plucking is optional, but I just want to go in for my preference. So I'm just tweezing some of the hair. Once again, I do not have a technique. I am just, I'm just plucking enough, but I'm not plucking a lot. So I am going in with my even tinted lace. She is in the color medium dark brown, as well as the Wonder Lace Bond from them. So we're gonna cut her with a razor. I'm seeing that a razor will give you that jagged look, so. putting her on she is long she is full <laughs> so immediately I was like no I'm not about to have this down this is too much hair too much you know now if this was a different color if this was more of streaks for me I would have liked it but yeah I'm like hmm let me see how I can style this Spraying her down. So I'm gonna have the sides out. I'm gonna do more of like an updo. Mind y'all, when I do this updo, this wig is not a 360 wig. So if you ain't got your kitchen in order, and for my people that know what a kitchen is, if you ain't got that in order, you know, line it up, shave it up, do whatever you need to do, it will, <laughs> It will look noticeable. It will kind of look like, okay, girl, what you doing? That's how mine was looking. But y'all, this is educational purposes, okay? Yeah. 
so I'm putting her up in a ponytail I'm like okay I'm liking it I'm liking it I'm liking it from the front okay But yeah, like I said, the back, make sure that it's taken care of. I end up putting clips within the actual wig, like the actual hair clips that, you know, you hold down and everything. Um, instead of bobby pins because I couldn't put my hands on bobby pins but I was really just trying to give y'all the gist of what it would look like if I would have had bobby pins so if you are trying to do this style make sure you have bobby pins and also also if you're trying to get this color and you're trying to put bobby pins I believe they have blonde bobby pins that would be extremely useful instead of getting the black bobby pins because you'll really see it versus the blonde bobby pins it can kind of camouflage throughout the hair I'm really loving, loving, loving how it is looking. It's giving me little Kim vibes. So my thoughts about Freya. Freya, again, was a very easy install. She did not tangle as much and she did not shed as much. Again, that is very surprising for a wig that is this color, that is this long with this type of texture. So I was honestly surprised, even with me even brushing out like the waves and the curls a lot of manipulation and she still held up the lace blended beautifully it blended really well with my skin once i put you know my makeup on on top of the lace but overall freya is definitely definitely a hit y'all so that is today's video i want to thank you guys for tuning in i would like to thank outre for sending me this unit freya is definitely a cute summer wig especially in this color what color was this hold on y'all this wig was in the color drff golden amber so thank y'all so much for coming back to my channel i appreciate y'all every single time and i'll talk to y'all later peace what a day what a day ah.